The Idris Shah Foundation presents The Way of the Sufi by Idris Shah First published 1968 Published in this edition, 2015 Read by David Alt To be a Sufi is to detach from fixed ideas and from preconceptions and not to try to avoid what is your lot. Abu Said son of Abi Kair. Do not look at my outward shape, but take what is in my hand. Jalaluddin Rumi Introduction The Sufi is one who does what others do when it is necessary. He is also one who does what others cannot do when it is indicated. Nuri Majudi So many people profess themselves bewildered by Sufi law that one is forced to the conclusion that they want to be bewildered. Others, for more obvious reasons, simplify things to such an extent that their Sufism is just a cult of love or of meditations or of something equally selective. But a person with a portion of uncommitted interest who looks at the variety of Sufi action can see the common characteristics staring him in the face. The Sufi sages, schools, writers, teachings, humour, mysticism, formulations are all connected with the social and psychological relevance of certain human ideas. Being a man of timelessness and placelessness, the Sufi brings his experience into operation within the culture, the country, the climate in which he is living. The study of Sufic activity in distant cultures alone is of value only to those working in the narrow field of scholasticism. Considering Sufi activities as merely religious, literary or philosophical phenomena will produce only garbled renditions of the Sufi way. To try to extract theory or system and to attempt the study of it in isolation is just as comparatively profitless. This book is designed to present Sufi ideas, actions and report, not for the microscope or as museum pieces, but in their relevance to a current community, what we call the contemporary world. Idris Shah